Um, and this is my quick review of Coffee Direct's Arabica Supremo Coffee Beans and Ca Coffee Direct, I've had a look on their website and they have been freshly roasting coffee since 2007 offering a selection of more than 100 wonderful origin coffees and coffee blends including rare and exclusive varieties and I can as I say, I can vouch for that because their website selection is vast, but they have a handy bean finder where you add your preferences and it will find the perfect coffee for your tastes. And all of their coffees are roasted to order and quickly delivered to ensure freshness. And I was uh, kind enough to speak to Miles from Coffee Direct and he um, sorted out a few coffees for me. So I've got, I think, two more coffees from Coffee Direct to try out. So a big thank you to Miles, who I spoke to. So let's take a look at the pack. And they've got a really good description on the pack, which most um, coffee roasters don't actually do. It says an extraordinary complex blend of 100% Arabica beans from five different coffee growing locations across the world puts Arabica Supremo high on the list of finest blends to be created. Deep, rich and smooth with an exotic spicy aroma. The recipe for this ingenious mix of high quality expertly roasted beans is a well kept secret but once tried you'll be left in no doubt as to how amazing it tastes. The um, bag is 227 grams, and there's the roasted on date, which was pretty soon after I received, or pretty soon before I received the coffees. And they put just under a year on the best before date, about nine months on the best before date. There is the web address, and I will add links in the description below for anyone who's interested in taking a look at Coffee Direct. And on the back it's got their story. It says Coffee Direct has been selling freshly roasted. And this is what I've <laughs> just read to you. What I found on the website. So I won't go through that again. So that is it for the pack. And a really good packaging. It's got a nice um, resealable um, top. And it's one of those sort of flat um, pack bags which I find really nice to have in the cupboard and let's take a look at the beans good quality large in size very even sort of roast very slightly oily but not as oily as some darker roast that you get and the aroma of the beans is smoky Slightly biscuity when I when I first opened the pack it was super pungent this coffee and that first sort of inhalation of the bag really took my breath away but it settled down a bit and is quite smooth overall it's sweet and caramelly with that spicy aroma mentioned on the pack just lurking in the background just my kind of coffee and I couldn't wait to get it in the grinder this one So let's take a quick look at the ground coffee. Slight orange look to this one. And when ground, it's a bit more vibrant with a nice bite to it. It's still sweet and caramelly with an added slight kind of marzipan hint. It's got a slight sort of meat stew kind of feel to it as well, which you tend to get from really freshly roasted coffees, I find anyway. So, taste wise, it's rich and smooth and strong with the slight spiciness there. 
It's really well balanced considering it contains five different coffees in it. It's dark but not oily so it's it's a good one for those um, bean to cup machines. If you like a dark roast, uh, as you know uh, bean to cup machines really do struggle with oily coffees. So this one being not too oily it should be okay this one. It's full bodied but in combination with the high-ish acidity it gives a sort of cleaner, lighter mouthfeel, if that makes sense. So it's not a heavy, creamy type full body. Um, and it's a good all day drink, this one as well. Uh, and I really enjoyed it. It's not delicate or complex, but a really well balanced coffee with an interesting tang to it. And I'll give it a score of 4 out of 5. It's well packaged fresh and good quality and as I say that they, they get it to you really quickly as well um, to guarantee the freshness of the coffee. It's easily recommended and I really do look forward to trying more coffees from Coffee Direct in the very near future so look out for those reviews. So yeah I'd really like to hear from anyone who's tried this coffee or any of the others from Coffee Direct let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and if you want to see more coffee reviews in the future, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.